what's up guys welcome back to my channel this is across nigeria where we do news on politics celebrities and also metro stories all right uh, remember uh, the posters that um, that was flooded in the city of abuja um, earlier today that is the 10th of april 2019 where um, okay you can see the poster on my screen here where I think Wabubaka was um, pictured um, with some kind of inscription um, all right so he has come out to um, to disclose to the general public um, about that uh, campaign posters okay so um, please before I give you this story if you have not subscribed to my channel there is a red subscribe button down the video below so you support me by clicking on that red subscribe button okay so the candidate the presidential candidate of the pdp in 2019 general election has disassociated himself from the controversial campaign posters flooding uh, the streets of abuja so the posters which carry his face okay which carry his face um with an inscription puka um so actually puka i i had to made some kind of research and finding and i get to um, know that poker is an indie word which means um genuine okay um so at, at i could remember he's still fighting um a tribunal case with challenging uh, president Buhari's victory um on the outcome of the 2019 presidential general election so Atiku says he was the real winner of the election okay so the case is um still in the tribunal so far so good um article with the evidence with a 136 page document evidence is submitted to the tribunal um also attached some figures okay some figures uh results of the election which he says river state was not recorded and he won the election with over um, one million votes so the case has been going on and uh, there's a lot of battle between Atiku Abubaka since he has not congratulated um, President Buhari uh, on the election, on the victory of that election. So uh, there was a poster that emerged in the city of Abuja. So the posters emerged after um, there was a report that literally said that the former vice president enlisted the assistant of two um, cerebral lawyers in Washington DC so Atiku has also um, come out to disassociate himself saying that um, nothing like that happened so um, there was a post actually that post um, came out from Sahara reporters where it was reported allegedly that Atiku Abubakar has um, seek the assistance of two lawyers in um, the US okay to lobby the American government for recognition as the winner of the last presidential election so reacting to the posters article media aid paul ebay in a statement uh, said that um, our attention has been drawn to the posters of his excellency Atiku apubaka presidential candidate of the pdp in the 2019 general election being circulated in abuja so he said um, we disassured the former vice president of nigeria from the said posters in circulation so the campaign season is over the chanted electoral victory by the incumbent is being challenged in court. We refu refuse to be distracted, which is exactly the objective of our opponent, but to remain focused on um, diligently pursuing our election petition with the view of retrieving the stolen mandate. Okay, so I made a video about uh, that enlisted lawyers that was allegedly reported that Atiku hired in the US and um, also this poster and um, I was with a friend and we were kind of discussing about it I said um, it could be actually not Atiku um, being involved in in the posters issue that it could be it, it could be an opposition you know it's possible I am not trying please um, 
I'm not associated to any political party. I'm not affiliated to any political party. Okay, so if you guys have anything to contribute, you can do that on the comment section below. Okay, so I just want to disassured myself so what I, what i'm doing here is just political news and so on okay so i'm not supporting any political party so um, we we're actually talking about that and uh, we also had to conclude that it could be Atiku may not even be aware of what is going on the news circulating it could be yes from the position trying to distract his um challenge okay in the tribunal so so far so good um the uh, media aid to Atiku has broken silence and said um, Atiku Abubakar is not aware of the post that has been circulated in the street of Abuja. All right, so I decide to bring the update of this news for you guys. So if you have anything to contribute, you can do that on the comment section below. And also, I want to use this opportunity. There is um, a YouTube video course about how to start a YouTube channel. Okay, grow your channel, reach the 1,000 subscribers and the 4,000 watch hour which will be accepted in youtube partner program and you start earning revenue from youtube so there is a video course on that so if you are interested you hit me up on the email address on the description box below then i will give you terms on how to get the video course so for now if you have anything to contribute based on this story all right what do you think will be the outcome of this article mandate challenge let me put it that way mandate challenge of the victory of President Buhari, do you think our jur uh, jur uh, judiciary will be able to act well? Okay, but we have seen what is happening. Um, PDP taking over some states from the APC from court. Okay, so um, I really don't know if it's gonna work when it comes to federal might like this. So, what do you guys think about this? Let me see your own contribution on the comment section below. I am out. I will see you guys in the next video.